Hi everyone, my name is Thomas Kim. Today is March 25th, 2020. In this episode, I will explain how to build static library of MPIR, MPFR, or GMP on Windows using Visual Studio 2017 and Visual Studio 2019. Please understand that my current episode continues from my previous episode. If you haven't watched my previous video, please double click this link and watch this video. Otherwise, you may not be able to follow my current session. Also, I posted all source code and samples in my website. You can double click this link, download the sample source code. Also, pre-built DLL files, also MPIR master source code. MPFR master source code. If you watched my previous video, how to build and use MPIR, MPFR, or GMP on Windows using Visual Studio 2017 and Visual Studio 2019, you understand the folder structure. So in folder, I provided all source code. And in our previous episode, we created the EVsoft folder in C drive. Disclaimer, I am an absolute beginner of GMP. If you need documentation for MPFR, you can double click this link and download MPFR documentation. Also, you can double click this link and download MPIR documentation. I haven't read this MPFR documentation, so I am an absolute beginner. Without further ado, let's get started. Start Visual Studio 2017, go to File, Open, Project and Solution, C Drive, DEVsoft, MPIR, MSVC, VS17, MPIR Solution. Click Open. Select Win32 Release Build. Right click. Properties. All Configuration, All Platform. Select Window SDK version that is installed on your machine. Click Apply. Click OK. Right click, project only, rebuild, LIB, MPIR, CXX. So we built successfully. Right click, properties, all configuration, all platform, Windows SDK version. I will select this version, click apply. Click OK. Right click. Project only. Rebuild. LIB MPIR GC. These are static libraries. We built successfully. Now, X64 release build. Right click. Project only. Rebuild. LIB MPIR CXX. I think this is for C++ interface. Right click, project only, rebuild LIB MPIR GC. We built successfully. Now close, solution, file, open, project solution, devsoft, MPFR, VC17, LIB, MPFR solution, open, LIB, MPFR, right click, properties, make sure all configurations, all platforms selected, Windows SDK version, select this version, click Apply, click OK. 
win32 release right click project only rebuild only lib mpfr you should build successfully now x64 right click project only rebuild only lib mpfr now close Visual Studio. In the File Explorer, New Folder, GMP, BS2017, Static, MPIR, LIB, Copy, DEB soft GMP VS2017 static new folder MPIR hit enter in this folder right click paste go up MPFR LIB copy DEB soft static make a folder MPFR hit enter double click it right click paste DEB soft GMP MPFR X64 release MP real GMP UTIL dot H right click copy DEV soft static MPFR X64 release right click paste static MPFR Win32 Release, right click, paste. We pasted the two files mpreal.h, gmputil.h. Now, right click, search, environ, edit system environment variables, environment variables, select path, path, Edit, click this one, edit, dash, static, copy, hit enter, edit, paste, enter, edit, Paste, enter, edit, paste, enter. Click OK. We created these environment variables in our previous episode. Click this one, edit. Paste, click OK, edit, paste, click OK, edit, paste, click OK, edit, paste, click OK. Now click OK, click OK. In our previous episode, we created this folder. Now I will copy, paste, right click, rename, static, right click, Rename 
static. Now start Visual Studio Open D Drive DEV Soft Tutorial GMP MPIR Static Click Solution Right click Properties C++ Code Generation Make sure all configuration all platform selected. It should be multi-threaded MT. We have to select this option for static library. Click apply. Click OK. Please understand that we created this sample in our previous episode. Now Ctrl F5. Our application runs successfully x86 this is 32 bit build control f5 our application works correctly now close it start visual studio 19 this is visual studio 2019 file open project solution dev soft tutorial mpfr static Solution, click Open, right click, Properties, C++, Code Generation, make sure all configuration, all platform selected, Runtime Library, Multi-Threaded MT, this is for static field, click Apply, Click OK. 64 bit debug build. Ctrl F5. So debug build is failed. Release build. Ctrl F5. X86. This is for Windows build. Ctrl F5. It works correctly. If you want to build a debug build, then right click properties all platform debug then MTD click apply click OK x86 debug build right click rebuild Ctrl F5. Also, X64, Ctrl F5. We have some warning message, but we will ignore it. I prefer dynamic library over static library. Environment, I will restore my settings. Instead of static library, I will use dynamic library. I will restore my path like this. Click OK. Also, I will restore it back to dynamic library. I fixed my environment variable like this. Click OK. Click OK. I will upload fixed complete library to my website. By the time you watch this video, you can use these links to download complete library. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching.